Good morning guys, how are you today? And I'm getting ready for work and I wanted to do it together with you. So, I don't have a lot of time, I need to get out of the house in about 15 minutes. So, let's start the video. If you're new to my channel, consider subscribing and hitting the notification bell. I'm using my primer by Tony Moly. This is the Silky Smooth Balm. So it has a balm consistency, if you can see, yep, I think so, and I take on the on my finger and warm it up, otherwise it will be flaky and it won't absorb in the skin the way that we want it to. So I already moisturized, I use the serum and eye, and eye cream and a face cream with sunscreen. <laughs> I didn't rub it enough. Sides of my face and my nose are most important because they're usually where the makeup fades away during the day okay so for my foundation i'm using a combination of wet and wild photo focus foundation in the shade classic beige which i thought is my color but it's definitely not it's too dark and i'm using essence stay all day 16 hours in the shade 10 which is soft beige and I'm combining these two together with my finger and it is still too dark I think I need something lighter to mix it with See? too dark and now let's tap it with the sponge tap, 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 tap. And this is the sponge by Nikia Joy Cosmetics I bought it a long time ago and I used it basically for applying her powder. I have her velvet finishing powder and I mainly used it for that but I just moved using it for foundation and so well, I don't know if I like this sponge, it absorbs the foundation and when you wash it, even after one wash, you can see the amount of foundation that comes out of it. So maybe I have one which is not so good because when I watched all of her videos, then she always says that it doesn't absorb a lot of material. So maybe I got a bad one. It happens. Okay. So I'm concealing with my bourgeois radiance reveal in the shade 02. I really want to finish this one, this is why I'm using it all the time lately. For my eye pri eyeshadow primer, I'm using You Better Work by Essence. And I'm applying it to the back of my hand. And this is also one that I want to finish, so I'm using only this one. I have a few others. I just bought the Smashbox one, Photo Finish Eye Primer. I have the MAC one, the Paint Pod in Soft Ochre. But I really want to finish this one, and so I can move on. It doesn't really make any sense, you know, because that costs, I don't know, two bucks. <sighs> a 
you know, I don't know. If you're not going to the gym, it's okay. But if you're going to the gym, then it runs into your ears. But now there is no gym anyway. So even if I want to go to the gym, I can't go to the gym because it is closed. And taking my powder, this is my Maybelline Fit Me in the shade 115. And I'm just applying a tiny bit under my eyes, tapping off the excess and applying it on my lid as well. Now I think I'll do the eyebrows because you can't really see that, that they, they are there. Stop, I'm using my e.l.f. instant lift <laughs> prop and so I don't know how many times do I need to repeat it in order for it to be remembered I guess a lot so I'll do my eyebrows and I'll be right back I also use my clear gel by Essence well it's not so clear anymore but it used to be so I'm using it on my eyebrows now let's do the bronzer and I'm using my BH Cosmetics Brilliance Bronzer in Coco Coty and I'm in love with this bronzer this is so pretty don't forget the type of the access on the back of your hand look how much access there is you don't want it to be on your cheeks Okay, I tapped off the axis and still look how much materials do I have on my face. So I'm taking it off again and just applying it like so. Tapping, I'm not just tapping, tapping, tapping. And let's tap off some blush and I'm using my revolution sugar and spice i don't know if you noticed but in the last few videos i'm using basically the same materials um, i don't know why i'm just lazy switching them i guess that's the reason and highlighter i'm using highlighter by Nikki tutorials with collaboration with Ofra. Let me back with this highlighter. I rediscovered it when I did my um, Nikki tutorials review on her palette, and I fell in love again in this highlighter. And well, I've been using it since, so I guess that says something. And I'm using my Juvia's Place Nubian 3 Coral Palette. Why do they do a French accent? I don't know. Okay, this is the palette. <laughs> I'm using this light gray in my crease as a transition shade. You probably won't see it. It's very very light color. You see it? Hardly, but it's okay. I'm going to the office, so I don't need something very very bold. I'm going on a gray skin color, and now I'm using this color here, this dark gray, and. This is the first time I'm using this color and I'm applying it, well I need a small mirror so let's take the BH Cosmetics one and use this small mirror and I'm tapping it in the outer corner well I almost placed an order at Julia's place why well, almost? well I almost put in my credit card but then I said, I don't know, why do I need more eyeshadow? It's not like they released anything new. I was planning to buy their purple one, purple mini. I think that's the name. 
and um, other two, the Nomad, I think, and two others that were on sale, the combination, I think the Mini, oh, I forgot the name, but never mind, I didn't buy it anyways. And then I saw that BH Cosmetics are having also a sale up to 80% discount. And I almost bought as well. What do I mean by almost bought? I mean that I filled in the basket, I calculated the shipping, and the shipping were too expensive, so I just gave it up. I'm using this color in my inner corner. So, I don't know, I didn't buy anything. And you know, Colourpop now has 48... No, I think it's over. It had 48 hours of free shipping, but I didn't buy anything. I thought it would be stupid because last time they had 25% off, I didn't buy anything. So, even though I almost bought see there's a repetition here I don't know I keep asking myself do I really need more eyeshadow palettes I have so many so I don't know I think maybe with my finger it will apply better and Yep, definitely better. Okay, that's it. Eyes are done. That is the time. Where is my phone? Phone phone. Where are... Oh, I have one minute left. How did I do that? Well, I didn't keep track on the time, so that's how it happened. Bummer. Okay, what? I have only mascara and lipstick, and I'm done. So I'm using my Essence Lash Princess false lash effect just going to do it very quickly and that's it just a quick lipstick my lip liner by Kiko the creamy Creamy color lip liner in the shade 301 that I really need to sharpen. Yeah, urgent sharpening. Nothing almost came out, and I'm using my Kiko. It's an old, oldie but a goodie. just a pretty color okay so this is the final look I had a great time so if you like this video gives it a thumbs up if you like to see more of these videos when I'm getting ready with you to go to work let me know in the comment section down below uh, ah, exactly 15 minutes yay <laughs> okay, catch you all in my next video. Bye!